So a pal of mine, a fellow content creator, a fellow Outriders ambassador reached out to PCF to ask a few questions in regards to the game. The response he got was actually pretty funny in a way in which it was just not expected and in my opinion it just goes to show the kind of people we are dealing with here. Today we get into it all. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe. Okay so a fellow content creator, a buddy of mine, someone who has covered this game from the very start, someone who is responsible for getting this game seen by millions of eyes and one of the very few content creators much like me who says it how it is. A content creator called Cloud Plays, whose channel I will link below. He like myself is also a part of a private Outriders Discord. The Discord as you'd imagine is full of content creators, but right now it's literally down to 5 active people, from 200 plus to 5 guys. I mean I do hover, I read some of the dev responses, but I will be real with yous. They just ain't my kind of people in there. Not that they are bad people or negative people, actually quite the opposite. It's just a group of people I just don't feel I fit in with. Much like 99% of the Destiny content creation community. Most of them, although we respect each other, well we did when I was a part of it, it was a community I just didn't feel I fit into. Probably more of a me problem if I'm honest. Well hey, so yeah, I do see what goes on in this private Outriders Ambassadors Discord. Now the community manager for Outriders is within this group, and if I'm honest with you, this dude tries his best to answer every question people put forth to him. He can't do much else in reality. Now Cloud Plays is also a member of this Discord, and he sent our community manager a private message, which reads, Mr. Arkin, would you be able to be a part of a video I'd love to assist the community in video form with some answers they are itching to find out. Would be just a short interview to try push out whatever it is you guys are doing to fix issues. I've been covering the game since before launch and I'm working as a part of the ambassadors team. Would love it if I could bring them the info they are itching to hear or even just the info you're already providing on Reddit but they are yet to see if that makes sense, basically to bring more awareness. So this is what Cloud put forth to the Outriders community manager. The community manager replied with, Thanks for getting in touch. At the moment this kind of activity doesn't quite fit with our upcoming plans. I am familiar with all the questions the community has and I am answering them the best I can with the information we currently feel comfortable sharing. There are many questions we are gearing up to answer at the right moment in time, but that isn't just yet. He also goes on to state, as a side note, I think requests such as these would be easier made if we didn't feel that the majority of your content were not targeted dunks on Outriders. Reviewing your channel, it appears that most of your videos these days are driving towards telling people how badly we are doing, rather than providing an objective view of given situation. <laughs> I mean, to some like myself, this response speaks volumes. First off, the game right now and has been in a bad state for a long, long while. That isn't Cloud's fault. The fact Cloud is only posting videos dunking on PCF and Outriders. I mean if there was anything coming through for players to look forward to instead of only news of patches fixing bugs creating more bugs and this being a cycle for months I mean this isn't Cloud's fault either. The only way to cover Outriders right now is in a negative manner. It's either a negative manner or not at all. There's literally nothing at all right now to post in regards to this game. This isn't Cloud's fault. So let's be real for a second. I am within the same boat. We have both made many videos trashing a game in its current state. In its current state because of who? We ain't trashing a game out of hatred for it. We are doing it out of love. We are doing it because we all know the kind of game this could be and should be. We trashed a game because right now it's trash and we are just being honest it is as simple as that. This response from the community manager does speak volumes when it comes to BCF though. It to me just projects what I've been seeing for a long while from the whole company. 
in covering this game and the way in which they have done things. And well if you say anything negative about their perfect game, they deem you the devil. The numbers with this game speak for themselves. If they handled the situation properly, it wouldn't be this bad. And back to the point of him saying, as a side note, I think requests such as these would be easier made if we didn't feel that the majority of your content were not targeted dunks on outriders. I mean Cloud here is reaching out to try and communicate you guys being PCF with his audience, answering questions they have, trying to no doubt resolve issues and build back up trust between his audience and outriders. You fobbing him off like this is exactly the reason the game is getting so much hate right now. It's that projection I've seen for a long long while, and it's the wrong way to go about things. It gives off the impression of it's either our way or the highway. If you don't like what we are doing, then oh well. It just isn't a good look. And you know what guys, I wasn't even going to make this video. But at the end of the day, why shouldn't I? Why should I hold back feelings? When it's clear, they ain't. The game's just a giant mess right now folks, and I just don't think it will ever recover at all. It's a shambles and it is a shame. Now if you do want to go and check out the original video by Cloud Plays because he uploaded and covered this, you'll find it linked below. But tell me your thoughts on these people. What do you think? Let me know. And on that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I'll see you on that next one.